we're back from the Jamie's Flea Market. And as you can see, this past week we have added a new family member. We have acquired this is Java, aka Ziggy, because Ziggy was his original name, but I wanted to name him Java. <laughs> because of the Java the Hut mishap. And there he goes. <laughs> Where you going? So I'm gonna keep an eye on him, but I'm gonna talk to you guys at the same time. So, before we get into what we bought today, we both, the, we did some Dirt the Durs. Yes. The Dirt toy hunt where we went to the exchange and all that when we first got back out into the world, we missed this in the hall. Picked him up. Stanley. Because once we have a house, we're going to have a Stanley shelf. Yes, just like a Darth Maul shelf. And then. He just licked you. He's so cute. When we were at Ollie's, see, we forgot. Yeah, um, when we were out in Geneva and off that way, we stopped at Ollie's on the way back in Menor. In case he grabbed a couple of Star Wars books. Yes, I love this guy. Ollie's is amazing for books. Like, I got some like $30 books for like $3.99. See if he stays. And then she got this Star Wars Lego collection. Which comes with the Lego. Which by the way is normally really expensive. Yeah it says it doesn't have a price. I didn't look it up. But it was only 10 bucks. Oh their price 70 Our price 10 which doesn't necessarily mean it was 70, but it, it's usually spot right. on. So. Tilt this up some. Get the footy. Get the job. He just likes to chill. So then on to today. Yes. Show your book first. Okay, so I uh, found the similar book. I'm going to show you in a second. Found the similar book. Someone wanted 10 for it. I said no. I was like, is there any way we can come down in price? The book I know that they can be expensive um they went down to seven but then we went, I walked away and I was like okay well I'll think about it and you know I would have bought it for seven if I couldn't find it anywhere else <laughs> he's gonna run <laughs> I'm watching him. um but I found a Darth Maul book for three bucks actually well it says episode one but it's my Darth Maul book <laughs> And we all know how I feel about Darth, Darth Maul. She also found a collectible card game that has her boy, Darth Maul. Oh boy, grab him. I got him. <laughs> Darth got Maul him. and Obi-Wan on the package. We'll open it up, play with it, check it out. But she got it because it's Darth Maul. Yes. At that vendor, because we were buying something already and it was cheap, I, I grabbed these tribe uh, kids fan club stickers I'm guessing they're old. No they're cards. Are they cards? They are cards. Oh they're from they're McDonald's. McDonald's. Yes. They're sealed. I'll probably open it and put it in a book. <laughs> Licking things. He's having lots of fun. <laughs> and then I grabbed this Kenny Lofton headliners just because it's an Indians guy and I always liked Kenny Lofton. But I didn't lick him, I promise. I was just taking my time. We're gonna get hurt. <laughs> he's a goober. He is a goober, but he's our goober. He fits in. Yes. And then I grabbed there's another guy we walked through, found yeah, some Dice Masters, know. Avengers vs. X Men and He's listening to me. The Uncanny X-Men, I got five packs of each. They were two for a dollar. I'll open those up in a later video. I don't have time to do it right now. So set those to the side. Yeah, that'll be that'll be fun to do. Yeah, those are fun. I, I used to buy those all the time. And they kind of stopped making them out of nowhere. I don't know what happened, but I have a whole bunch of them. Hi. <laughs> he's, he's right in David's hands. He's walking much. around. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's licking. He's giving licks. <laughs> <laughs> Should see him eat some grasshoppers. I might put that at the end of the video. 
Uh, crickets. Or crickets. I keep saying grasshoppers, crickets. So then that same booth, Cassie found Luke Skywalker. Mm-hmm. All beat up in the Stormtrooper gear from the Death, Scar Death Star Escape, the exclusive from somewhere. We're not sure where. I have to look that up. Um... But we got that from Ben Lovejoy. Yes, from our group. a member from our group who has a stand in there. Yeah, who has a stand. Yep. Same guy had the. Look, John dice is ready masters. to attack the Star Wars Black Series. Yep, I had to show you guys. He's like, oh, I'm gonna get you. Rawr. Oh. <laughs> He's seen an opening. He's like, <laughs> trying to make a break for it. <laughs> you will get hurt if you fall off the table, cutie oh, pie. Absolutely not. We will keep an eye on him. So. So then when we first walked in, you all saw the big toy store that they have there. I mean, there's lots of toys in there at different booths, but there was one like store. It's not necessarily connected to the flea market. It's just kind of there. Yeah, it's its own little store. It's called the Groovy Little Toy Store. Mm -hmm. And it is kind of groovy. Yeah, they were nice. Um, they're, actually, they're really nice. Um, a lot of people say they're overpriced, but honestly, like maybe a couple things, but every yeah. store has that. Um, Six in one, half dozen in the other. Yeah. I didn't understand what that meant for the longest time until David explained it to me because I feel stupid. Um, but honestly, I love their store. They were genuinely nice. They actually care about their customers. Um, and they gave me a really good deal, which if everything lines up the way it's supposed to and I can get it, hopefully August, you guys can see what I'm talking about. If it's still there. If it's still there. So we'll see. I'm playing with the dragon. Well, okay, let's focus on this. Okay, so ADD. they had a sale going, buy one, get one half off, so. Yeah, which, which is perfect. Cassandra right? found Shocker. this uh, Imperial Hover Tank Pilot. Which is a Toys R Us exclusive. Got the little true sticker. Okay, oh, I'm making a break for it again. <laughs> so she was buying this guy. Yeah, and he was at a really good price. He was only 20 bucks. Yeah. So we got him and, for 10. And for a true exclusive, anywhere right now, it's it's like, oh my gosh. And um, he usually goes for about, what, like 40, 50 bucks? Something like that. Yeah. So I was like, oh, okay. Well, 10 bucks. Heck yeah. So then what did you get? So I was strolling through the legends and I decided to pick up this war machine, which leaves us to only need two more to complete the Hulkbuster. Hulkbuster okay. set. But the roadie sculpt on the face really sold me. Looks so much like Don Cheadle that I was just like, yeah, I like that one a lot. So that was the one that I picked. It was like 30 bucks, so that was a steal for him. Oh yeah, it was great. Um, so. And like, of course, we always look at our prices before we buy because, I mean, we have to save money just like everybody else because, you know, expensive. This is expensive to do. Yes. And unfortunately, it's not just, you know, pennies on the dollar every single time. So Sometimes we got to spend a little bit more than we want to. Yeah. So, but it's worth it in the end and it makes us happy. So, and just like you guys. <laughs> so... Oh. I got him. Why are you going to lick everything? <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Oops. Thank you for watching. Um, please comment, like, and subscribe. And if you subscribe, you'll see more of this little guy potentially. Potentially, especially because he likes being held. Mm -hmm. <sighs> and playing on the table, apparently. Apparently. So, we will line it all up, and that will be the end of this. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, so there's the whole haul lined all up like we always do. We appreciate you watching. Stay tuned, and we will see you next time.